Well, in the summertime, it seems like a lot of people are moving, doesn't it? And uh, I'm one of them. I left my last assignment as pastor at St. Lawrence Church in Buffalo, and then I took a study sabbatical. I was three months in Rome, and now I'm back in western New York in Buffalo, New York, in the diocese, and I'm temporary administrator of Annunciation Church, so I'm really living out of a, a suitcase until I know where I'm going permanently, and that means I'm using things that aren't mine and a grill that's not mine, all this stuff, but you can still cook no matter where you are. You find the things you need, and you make it work somehow. One of the things, though, that amazes me is that people will pay good money for garlic bread rather than making it themselves. Garlic bread, of course, is one of the easiest things to do. It's always nice to have bread to share with someone, isn't it? You take your bread. you got to get French bread. There's no big problem finding that. Take a half a stick of butter. A uh, little chopped fresh parsley in this case is the best, and because it's summertime, it's bountiful and available. Uh, however much garlic powder you like. I like to use the powder in this because it really integrates into the butter better than the, the chunky pieces. But if you're against that, then use the chunky pieces. And then you mix it all up. This is really good stuff. And then you just spread it ever so lightly, yes, well, a little bit thickly, on the bread. Roll it up very lightly in some aluminum foil lightly because I want some of the heat to get in there. Throw it on the grill or in the oven. You pull it out about 10 minutes later. Now you don't want it to get too hard or, or crispy. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's, oh, that's hot and really hot and really that's going to be tasty and it'd be wonderful to dip in spaghetti sauce or uh, chowder, nice corn chowder in the summertime. Or how about even a clam bake, that lovely clam juice you know, you don't have to buy it in the frozen food section. You can do it almost as easily yourself. Uh, nice being with you on Food for Thought. I'm Father Paul Seil, and see you next time.